What's going on guys? We are back in the video editing studio today. I'm going to show you how to fade in and fade out of your videos in CapCut PC. So let's get right to it. Step number one is to go to CapCut, obviously, right? And we are going to be editing the video and learning how to fade in and fade out. So step number one, make sure that you have your video down here in the editing timeline and it is highlighted, right? See the difference? If I click out, it's not highlighted. We want, we need this to be highlighted. So click on it and then go up here in the right hand corner and click on video tab. And then uh, scroll down a little bit. It says blend. See this right here, blend on the right hand side. So click that and drop down menu should open. And what we need to do here, this is a little confusing. So you're gonna have to pay attention. So on the fade in where you want it to start, go down to the editing timeline and then choose where you want it to fade in. Usually it's at the beginning of a video clip, right? So move this cursor and uh, put it where you want to start it, right? So then come over here back where it says blend. And then what we need to do here, see this little diamond thing right here? This is where we start adding keyframes because we need to tell CapCut where we want to add a keyframe to start and blend in or add a keyframe to blend out. So we want to blend in. So we need to add a keyframe, right? And then you need to choose the opacity, which would be black because we want it to go from black into the video, a fade in, right? So then that's the first keyframe. See the little diamond there on our timeline? And then move the move the cursor on where you want it to fade in. And you're gonna go add another keyframe over here. So add that second one, add keyframe. And you can see it puts a little diamond here on the video timeline editor. And then for the opacity, we're gonna have that 100%. And this is essentially how you do the fade in in CapCut. So let's click play here. See that fade in? And again, you can do it a lot longer. You can do it slower. Just choose where you want it to be. So that's how you do a fade in and cap cut. So a fade out is usually at the end of a video clip, right guys? So what we're gonna do is go to the end and let's move the cursor where we want it to be the complete end, right? That's why I always start where it kind of blacks out, the fade out. Move that cursor there and then go add a keyframe right here, that little diamond thing again, remember? And then we're going to choose the opacity to be zero because we're fading out to blackness. And it added that little keyframe on the timeline editor there. And then where we want it to choose, where we want to choose for it to start to fade out, move the cursor again, and then go back over to the keyframe, add it, and then choose the opacity to be 100%, right? And this is how we do a fade out. So watch this. If I click play here, that's the fade out. That's how it works. And you can see it added the keyframes in the video. So hopefully this video helped you guys learn how to fade in and fade out in your videos in CapCut PC. Please hit up the comments if you have any questions, please consider subscribing. This is my tutorial on how to fade in and out of your videos in CapCut PC. Peace out guys.